Hello everyone and welcome to another Matrix video. I'm Tom from Matrix and in this video I will explain the basic concepts and show you the Matrix editor. Matrix displays commands as a grid of buttons. You can organize several of those grids, we call it pages, into a deck. Like a deck of cards. You can download community-made decks for your favorite game or application from our gallery at matrixapp.com. When you start Matrix for Windows, you will be shown the editor. It is used to manage and edit decks. On the left is the library. It contains button templates and decks on your PC. Middle part is the page layout editor. This is where you arrange your buttons. To the right is the properties panel for the deck and the selected button. You can switch between deck and button properties panel using the tabs on top. By default, the button properties panel shows just the title and the action. To access all the customization options, click the customize button. It is hard to miss. Now let's create a deck and see just how easy it is. Click new to create a new deck, a simple remote control for YouTube. We will add the first button onto our page by dragging a template from the library, like so. The first button will pause and unpause the video, so let's give it a title Play Pause. To play or pause video we need to simulate pressing the spacebar, so we choose hotkey action in the button properties, click on the hotkey capture field and press the spacebar on the keyboard. We can add previous, next, sound mute, unmute and full screen toggle buttons the same way and assign the appropriate key combinations. When we're done with it, click save to save the deck and let's try it out. Let's open the Matrix app on the smartphone and select the YouTube remote deck. Without getting into discussion on the state of today's pop music, we can conclude that we successfully turned our smartphone into a remote control for YouTube. Thank you for watching, have a great day and see you in the next video.